Welcome to Go. Today we are standing in front of the Kelowna Community Theatre where right now the cast and crew from Kelowna Actor Studio are busy getting ready for the spectacular musical Mary Poppins. They're taking out all the stops for this one and we're going to give you an exclusive preview coming up on the show. Now we're talking to Randy Leslie standing on the stage with this fantastic set. Randy, this is a huge production. Yeah, it's our first time in the Kelowna Community Theatre as Kelowna Actors Studio and uh, we're bringing out all the stops. No kidding. I mean, you gave us a little bit of a preview backstage. You got like pneumatics and people flying in massive sets. Yeah, it's uh, we wanted a Broadway level show, and that's what we're going to give the audiences. And it's a it's a spectacular show, just when the acting and singing, etc. But the other point is all the special effects. So there's something for everyone. Doesn't matter how old you are. Yeah, I mean, I've talked to a lot of people that are excited about the show. Everyone from my mom yeah. to my little grandkids yeah, exactly. are all like ready for this. Exactly. It's uh, it's one of those shows that you either grew up watching the movie or uh, I know that we watch it during lunch with some of the uh, summertime classes at Kelowna Actors Studio. So it's a classic that everybody loves. So talk a little bit about this. I mean, it must take a lot to get... You know, people flying. Yeah, we uh, have uh, some magic flying for Mary, but there's also a surprise, which you'll get a little sneak peek of, no. with Bert the chimney sweep, who right. goes over the rooftops. So we uh, hired a company out of New York and Chicago, uh, Vertigo Fly Company, and they came in and trained our people. And uh, yeah, there's some real magic that happens. It must be nice to have this much room. I mean, I know you love your theater, yeah. uh, but it must be nice to be able to just Go for it. Well, we have some amazing sets that move on and off the stage, and there's a lot of wing space here that we're able to do that here. But at uh, our theater, it's a much smaller scale. That's going to be an exciting show. I can't wait to, to see a little bit more, and we're going to continue looking around backstage, okay. if that's all right, and yeah. checking out some of, the, some of the delights that you have in store. Sounds great. Good. Enjoy. Now we're talking to Nick. That's the great opportunity here. You get to play Bert. I do. I love it. It's a very iconic role and um, one that I've looked forward to possibly getting on stage and doing for a number of years since we saw it in, on Broadway in, um, in, well, in New York. I mean, I'm, you know, I grew up with the movie watching Dick Van Dyke do, the, you know, just so amazing. What does it feel like to have somebody that you've, you know, sort of a role that you've looked forward to playing to finally get to do it. Uh, here, it and here on a big stage too with all this stuff. I know, it's, it's a little overwhelming. I, I mean, and the, typically I guess I've talked to some other actors who have played Burton and, and the role's a little overwhelming because you, you do a lot of things in the show, but, um, um, but actually getting on stage is, is a lot of fun. And, and the best part of the show is I get to fly, so. You get to fly? Yeah. What do you mean you get to fly? I just, I just lift up and f fly you away. Just it's fly fun. away <laughs> like that. <laughs> that's got to be pretty cool. Maybe you could just come back down. Okay, okay yeah, there you go. <laughs> Wow, that's got to take a lot. Um, it took a lot of training, actually. The, we had a company come in from, from New York um, that helped us with, um, with the process and, and a few days of training and uh, lots of practice. And I, I completely freaked out at the beginning, and, but near the end, it gets a little fun. So you trust these guys now? I trust these guys with, with my life, obviously. Well, obviously. Well, yeah. I mean, I guess this is one of the things that you just can't really, um, you can't really do necessarily in the actor studio space, where, where, where here you've got this extra room and, and, and all of that. True, yeah. We, there's no way we can actually fly in the Kelowna Actor Studio space. So when we decided we were going to do Mary Poppins and bring it to the KCT, that this was a major deciding factor. So. Stick around. Coming up after the break, we'll bring you even more from here backstage at Mary Poppins. Doug, what are you doing back here? You're what? not allowed back here. But, uh, you know how much I like to be Doug, part of things, Doug, Brandon? Doug, you're not in this show. I, I know, but I just want to like kind of... You're in that so show. I'm on... Take that show outside. Okay. Uh, sorry, guys. Oh. Okay. We'll be right back. Time is up. Bye, Doug. Now, this is something that I have never seen on a set in, uh, in a theater in Kelowna before. There's this... Big air tank here connected to this valve, which is connected to this uh, valve here, which I've been told not to touch, right, Rick? That's right, don't touch. But not unless you want magic to happen. Th that's a magic valve. It is, it's a magic valve, it really is. And it controls some of the things, the magic that happens in the kitchen for Mary Poppins set. So There's this a is a, a pneumatic setup, so that uses air pressure to move pistons and levers and things, right? Ex exactly, exactly. It, it, basically, this one here controls, there's a shelf here and it controls that, but I'm not going to give you much more yeah, than that. Yeah, we can't, we can't show you what's going to happen. You have to come and see this because uh, uh, we, we walked around and looked, but we, we, we're not allowed to show you, but it's really, really cool. Yeah, it's what did it take to design something like this? 
uh, an engineering degree, which I don't have. So <laughs> no, I was very fortunate. I had some good, you know, the internet is amazing. And, you know, I, I have some contacts in the States that I was able to get a hold of. And they sort of walked me through a number of the things that they've done with some of their shows. And so we put it all together. And, yeah, it's pretty exciting to watch and see, you know, when it comes to fruition like that. You know, you've planned it for months. And then you build it. And, you, you know, everything looks good on paper. But when finally you see it happen, it's, it's yeah, it gets the goosebumps happening a bit. Wow, I can't wait to see it in actual operation. Thanks so much. Oh, you're very welcome. Thanks, Doug. Okay. Now we're talking to Dharma, who plays Mary Poppins. How cool is that? I know, it's really cool. I mean, she was an idol when I was growing up. Like, I always used to watch her movies, and now I'm actually playing her, which is amazing. What's the best part about playing Mary Poppins? I don't know. I think just... I think being with so many people on stage, that's my favorite part of acting, is just having that like family feeling of everyone there. And like I'm always on the stage, so there's always people there with me that share the like, you know, the great moments on stage. So I think that's my favorite part. Well, we're just about done with our show, but look who we have found backstage, our Hello. old pal, Anna Jackson. How's it going? <laughs> it is really good, and yeah, isn't this funny? You're all in your costume and makeup. Who are you playing? I am. I'm Mrs. Banks. I'm playing the mother of the two children that Mary Poppins comes and changes, and our whole lives are being changed because of the lovely Mary Poppins. So what's this like for you? Well, it's completely a different genre for me. I mean, as a jazz singer, I'm used to my graspy, low, sexy voice, and I'm used to doing that, waking up and just, you know, singing whereas here it's a different genre I have to completely think differently sound differently and uh, act differently so what's act. That, I, I, what does that sound like like give us give us an example uh, like fly me to the moon and then with this I go in the most delightful way well, that's <laughs> very delightful thank you so much and thanks to everybody don't forget this is a, a, a incredible show you're gonna get your tickets early it's already selling like okay. hotcakes so hotcakes. That is it for us. I'm Doug Brown. I'm Anna Jackson. <laughs> we'll see you next time on Go.